Hello everyone! Mabuhay! Here's my box! I told you in my previous video that I'm going to get another Philippine species mottled leaf phalaenopsis and here it is. I am so excited! I ordered this online from a seller I found in our Facebook group. I wanted to order from Purification Orchids Philippines because I got my Lindeni there but they don't have the Philippinensis. And I also ordered other orchids para hindi sayang ang shipping fee. Ayan, open na! Surprise! Hindi pala nakabalot. Okay! Kunin ko na. Oops, this one first. Meron bang laman? Ay, meron. What's this? Is this my Filipinensis? Ngi. What? One leaf fell. So, this is my Phalaenopsis philippinensis. The seller said that this orchid is already established and a blooming size, but I don't think so. I bought this for 350 pesos, same price with my Lindeni, and this is so sad. I hope that I can successfully grow it because I'm not an expert. Sana mabuhay pa. I'm sorry if I'm making you feel sad. I'm taking this one very carefully and let's forget about that file first. Yes. Happy lang! Positive tayo! No worries! And this might be my Vanda Boxali or also known as Vanda Lameliata Var Boxali. And this time, I'm happy with the orchid. Here's a keiki. So basically, I got two in one. I paid 350 pesos for this one and the main plant shows that it already flowered two times already. This Vanda is a small growing epiphyte native to the Philippines. And I hope this one flowers for me soon. This Vanda seems to be taken off from a branch and I'm not sure if it's from a mother de cacao tree grown outside or from trees. I'm not sure and I'm sorry about that. Next time, I will ask and I should know. But for this one, I have a bonus keiki and I'm happy about that. I will show you close-up pictures of these orchids before the end of the video. These orchids don't have ID tags so I'll just guess because I only ordered few orchids and they are very different from each other. So this one must be the Dinrobium amethystoglossum. And if you haven't seen one in bloom, I will place in the description a link of a video from Miss Orchid Girl. This orchid is wrapped with moss, maraming canes, and Here's the roots. I will show you how I pot this orchids in my next video. So I hope that you'll watch out for that. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me in this hobby and let's be friends. I'll post my Facebook and Instagram accounts in the description. Sometimes I don't have internet connection, but I will try to respond as soon as I can. I still have one more orchid to open, but before that, I would like to thank my subscribers. Thank you for subscribing.
and that's the Dendrobium Amethyst Glosso. I paid 400 pesos for that. Sorry for the other talks, this is the last orchid. I mentioned about this in my previous video and the seller has a small size so I bought this. Vanda Luzonica and I paid 1000 pesos for this one. This is their smallest size. I will include in the description links to articles about the orchids I have here. Vanda Luzonica is named after the island of Luzon, Philippines and it can grow quite big. The flowers are beautiful white flowers with streaks of purple and pink lip. Before I show you the close-up pics, I have to show you this first. I got myself a fiddle leaf fig tree. I always saw this online and since we will be moving in our house this summer, I thought that I will grow this here first. This is the first time I saw this plant in person, in life, and I don't know how to take care of this. I just read the articles from the internet, and if you have suggestions or tips on how I can grow this successfully, please share in the comments. I'd love to learn them from you. Especially those of you who lives in warm climates and for those of you who are living in the Philippines, mga kababayan, how do you take care of this? And here are the pictures of the orchids in this unboxing. Join me in potting these orchids in my next video. Thank you for watching. Maraming salamat. Paalam. See you in my next videos. Thank you.